BJGT, which is a Visual Geometry Grounded Transformer, published by the Visual Geometry Group, University of Oxford, and also Meta AI. The paper was published in CVPR 2025 conference, and as of 14th March was made publicly accessible, and is as of the March end has 3.8k plus stars under its GitHub repo. So it isn't just another computer vision model. It uh, it revolutionizes the approach that tackles 3D scene understanding in a single forward pass using a massive transformer. Imagine feeding it a set of images, and in less than a second, it predicts camera poses, depth maps, point cloud, and point tracks all at once, often outperforming traditional methods in speed and accuracy. Let's break down the problem it solves, how it works, the experimental results, and what it all means for the future of 3D vision. In 3D computer vision, the goal is to reconstruct the three-dimensional world from two-dimensional images. This is essential for applications like robotics, augmented reality, and self-driving cars, where machines need to understand their surroundings in 3D. Traditionally, this is handled by SFM, a multi-step process involving steps like keypoint detection, matching, triangulation, and bundle adjustment. SFM works, but it's slow, it's iterative. For a small set of images, it might take seconds or minutes, but for large scenarios, it can take up to several hours. Errors can also accumulate across steps, especially in complex environment. BGGT redefines this whole problem. It takes multiple images, let's say 10 photos of a room, and predicts everything in one go. The camera location, pixel depth, a full 3D point cloud, and even how points move between frames. No separate stages, no waiting, just a single fast pass through the model. BGGT leverages a transformer architecture, a, t a type of neural network famous for its success in generally in language models like GPT, uh, adapted here for vision tasks. Uh, here's how it processes images and delivers its prediction. Each image is split into patches and converted into tokens or data chunks using DNO v2, a pre-trained vision model that, that extracts rich visual features. Transformer backbone is where these tokens are passed through 48 layers of attention, 24 layers of frame by self attention and 24 layers of global self attention, where focusing on individual images and connecting information across all images is done respectively. This alternating pattern lets VGGT understand both local details within each image and global 3D structure across views. After processing, specialized outputs predict the camera poses, the depth maps, the point maps and the point tracks. Uh, what's unique about this is that VGGT predicts all these outputs in an over-complete manner where some could be derived from the other, like for example point maps could be derived from depth and poses, but training them together boosts accuracy. It also, it's also permutation equivariant, meaning it can handle unordered image sets. Except for a reference frame, it can handle everything else effortlessly. Uh, VGGT's power comes from its training where it has 1.2 billion parameters and was trained on 64 NVIDIA A100 GPUs for 9 days. It uses bfloat 16 precision and gradient checkpoint to manage memory. The data was a massive and diverse of real datasets and synthetic ones with millions of images annotated with depth, poses and tracks. Augmentation was also done where random color jitter, Gaussian blur, grayscale conversion was done to make it robust for real world imperfections. Loss, a multitask loss optimizes all outputs, poses, depths, points and tracks simultaneously. This diversity and scale allows VGGT to generalize to new scenarios, not to just memorize its training data. Experimental results where VGGT beats the best. VGGT was tested across multiple tasks consistently outperforming the state of the art methods. Here's a rundown for the camera pose estimation, the multi view depth estimation, point map estimation, and image matching. For downstream tasks, few fine tuned features achieve PSNR of 30.41, LPIPS of 0.07. Alternating attention, where the full setup beats global only or cross attention, proving the frame wise and global balance is critical. There is data diversity, uh, where full mix outperforms uh, the specific data sets or the synthetic only data sets, showing variety drives generalization. Multitask learning, where jointly training all outputs enhances performance, and geometric learning, where VGGT learns concepts of epipolar geometry, triangulation through attention without hard code, hard coded rules. Its speed, which is 0.2 seconds per scene, accuracy and versatility makes it ideal for real time applications. Think about, for example, robots navigating, AR apps rendering scenes or car mapping roads. 
by learning 3D relationships directly from data with transformer. VGGT pro proves that we don't need slow iterative pipelines anymore. It's a glimpse into the future of computer vision where massive models tackle com complex problems end to end.